book lovers, it's Jenny at Julia Baby Jen's Beanie Room, and this is Friday Reads for January 31st. Alright, so this is what I'm going to be reading this weekend. I am really, really excited. I've been waiting almost a year for it. Into the Still Blue by Veronica Rossi is out and I bought it. I bought a um I bought it an ebook actually. I was going to go shopping yesterday and buy the hardcover, but it was snowing and it wasn't like it was horrible outside, but it's a little slick and it's I don't know, 30 miles uh to the nearest large city to me and I just didn't really feel like driving. 30 miles to, and then driving around in town there, and then driving 30 miles back. I mean, there was other stuff I was going to get too, but mainly I was going for the book. So it just, I wasn't that motivated to do it, I guess. So I did not go out yesterday to buy it. I thought maybe I would get up early this morning and go. And the more I thought about it, the more I just decided, you know what, I'm just going to buy this an ebook this time. I don't need a hardcover of this one. It would be nice, but... The I don't own the first book, and the second book I have is ebook as well. So and I don't have any of the other two, so I don't feel a huge need to go out and buy the hardcover, I guess. So I just bought it as an ebook, and I'm going to start reading it today. And I'm super excited. My friends are all joining me, and and yay! I really hope it's a good ending. I loved Through the Evernight. I liked it Under the Never Sky quite a bit, and I loved Through the Evernight. So I am really hoping I love it. So yay, very excited. That's going to be my kind of my key read. So because it's an ebook, I don't have anything to really show you. It's on my phone, which I'm using to record. Um, and then I am going to read another uh, ebook this weekend. It's actually an e-arc that I got from NetGalley from an indie author. Um, it's Unite by Jamie Campbell. And I wasn't going to read this one this weekend, but um, I had downloaded... The prequel novella was free on Amazon, and I saw it, so I grabbed it. And last night, I was kind of laying around in bed, and I wasn't feeling very motivated yesterday. I just wasn't feeling myself, and and I wasn't really in the mood to start. I just finished um, Impossible by uh, Nancy Whirlin, and um, I loved it. But after that, I just didn't feel the need to get into another book so much at that moment. So I just went through my Kindle to see if I had any, like, quick stories or novellas. And I saw that sitting and I'm like, oh, I'll read this. So I read it and I really liked it. It was really good. I had no idea what the series was even about. Um, I just, um, I liked the cover and I thought I would request it and see if I got it and I did and so I thought oh, I should probably read it and so I decided I'm gonna go ahead and read the book this weekend because the novella interested me enough I, it did really explain a lot in the novella but my feeling is that it's about um that she's an alien trying to blend into earth is what the the gist I got she was at summer camp in this story and um these uh I don't know, the bad guys, whoever they are, because it didn't really explain it very well, were looking for her and trying to track her down while she was at summer camp. So um, I was uh, I was really intrigued by it, and I'm like, ooh, I think I want to read this this weekend. So that is what I'm going to read for my e-arc uh, this weekend is Unite by Jamie Campbell. And I thought I'd grab a library book. Um, I am reading right now Altered by Jennifer Albin. Um, which is a sequel to Cruel, and I have it as a library book. I'm buddy reading it with a few of my, my girlfriends, but we're they all joined me for the Into the Still Blue buddy read this weekend, and one of them is on vacation, and the other one is still reading Cruel. So I decided I'm going to just kind of set aside Altered for the weekend and maybe pick it up again on Monday, although I was really into it. Um, just... So I'm, because if I read it this weekend, I'll finish it. I have a feeling that if I pick it up again, I will finish it all the way through. And then neither one of my friends are really reading it at the moment. And it's kind of the point of the buddy read is to read it with your friends. So I will wait a few days to read Altered. So instead I picked up um, Pantomime by Laura Lamb. 
Um, my library just got this in. This book's been out for a while, but my library just got this in, and it looks so intriguing, and I've heard good things about it. It's not wildly popular, but for some reason, but it sounds interesting. It has, I think, kind of a steampunk vibe to it as far as the time period, but it's about a circus. So it's got like a magical, creepy element to it too. I don't know a lot about it, but it looks really good. And I actually, my library got this and the sequel. So I have this one and the sequel to read. So I'm going to try to read this this weekend and I will let you know if I like it. And that is my Friday reads. Um, I work this weekend. Tomorrow morning I have to take um, my youngest daughter Tessa to the eye doctor. And that is it for my weekend. So not a very exciting one, but... I'm reading into the still blue, so it will be exciting for me. So I hope you guys all have a good weekend, and I will talk to you later. Bye.